a touchscreen monitor into an Android retail tablet. He is a Windows-based Match Touch Monitor AOC branded. As we can see from the marketing sticker, it is a, this is a Windows 8 10-point touch display. We assume this monitor is recognized by the Windows as a HID compliant device. Let's verify it now. So as we can check from device management, we check human input device. We can see the HID compliant device. This part is new after we plug uh, this, uh, the, the USB. So this is uh, the very HID device. As we can see the hardware ID info. You can see the, the details of the parameters like HID 0457 and PID 11B4. Since we understand this, and uh, we know what the multi-touch monitor can be recognized by, by, by Linux as well, so we assume we are able to create an uh, Android-compliant driver for this uh, touchscreen monitor. This is, a, this is a driver we call display uh, fmprparam.cfg. So the, the two lines, the, the first two lines is for the display mode and the display type. And uh, the second part is HID, VID, PID. It's identical with what we found from the Windows-based interface. Now let's check uh, whether it works on our Android device, our touch box. So we insert the USB, we insert HDMI, and let's power on. Android logo, this is booting up. Before we operate this, we already uh, uploaded the, the driver into the system. So Android, and it goes up to our touch screen profiler, you can see. This is uh, what we create, a uh, Bluetooth speaker e-catalog for uh, our customer. So great, we call this player King Kong and model number is MP23.